Hi, I'm Sayadan Mas online. Today we'll try to see why e power of minus infinity value is equals to zero. We can get this result by using either the formula for e power of x or you can get this by using the formula of e power of minus of x. But today I'll try to get this value by using the formula for e power of x. So we know the value of e power of x. Its formula is 1 plus x plus x square by 2 factorial plus x cube by 3 factorial and so on. And suppose if I uh, want to find out e power of minus infinity, which means I want e power of minus of x. So can I write this e power of minus of x to be equals to 1 by e power of x. So I'll write this as a positive e power of minus of x which is negative when it comes to the denominator it becomes a positive value. So now if I try to uh, write down it is 1 by e power of x value is nothing but 1 plus x plus x square by 2 factorial plus x cube by 3 factorial and so on. Now suppose if I write down the value of x to be equals to infinity. So as x tends to infinity, what will happen in this case? So it becomes e power of minus of infinity. On the right hand side, the value of x is tending to infinity. So you'll be getting 1 by 1 plus. So all this value, wherever you have x value, so here, so it will be infinity. So over here x is infinity, over here x is infinity, over here x is infinity. All the terms it is infinity. So the sum of all infinities will be infinity itself. So 1 plus infinity. We know that 1 plus infinity is again infinity itself. So we will be getting 1 by infinity. And we know that 1 by infinity is what? 1 by infinity is nothing but 0. So therefore we will be getting the value of e power of minus of infinity to be equals to 0. So that's all I have for today. Thank you.